There's a man Ballers. in New His name is Uncle Bob. He came into an apartment one day. He bust in the door, guns drawn. He saw nobody. He saw legs on the floor. It was my legs. He saw blood everywhere. A bunch of police hopped over me. He refused to do so. He said EMS tried twice and they told him, there's nothing. He refused to let that die. He brought me to the hospital himself. He refused to wait. He kicked in the doors. He said, you, you get whatever you got to do and you make sure this child make it. That day, Uncle Bob was a homicide detective. He was off on detail. He just heard the call and came. I saw him the other day. I said, Uncle Bob, let me help you in any kind of way. This man has two amputated legs. He refused to stop. He's not in a wheelchair. He's walking. You know what he asked for? A job. Lil Wayne is mourning the death of former New Orleans police officer Robert Hubler, whom he endearingly referred to as Uncle Bob after he saved the rapper's life following his suicide attempt at age 12. Everything happens for a reason. I was dying when I met you at this very spot. You refused to let me die, Wayne wrote via Instagram on Monday, July 25th, beneath a photo of Hubler. Everything that doesn't happen, doesn't happen for a reason. That reason being you and Faith. R.I.P. Uncle Bob. Aunt Kathy been waiting for you, ill love and miss you both and live for us all. According to the New Orleans advocate, Hubler was found dead in his old Jefferson, Louisiana, home. He was 65. His grandson Daniel Nelson said that he suffered from lingering health issues stemming from a car accident and struggled with diabetes, which eventually led to both of his legs being amputated.